in this part of the video we will learn practically about the chapter spreadsheet functions and chart for better understanding but before we begin let's consider a few points a function is a built-in formula that can be used to perform a calculation on the data in your worksheet functions are ready-made formulas that perform a series of operations on a specified range of values for example average count max and sum in today's practical class we will learn to perform sum average max and min function so let's begin i hope all of you are ready so let's start first we will click on start button then we will click on all programs microsoft office and then we will click on microsoft office excel 2007 here i have two versions microsoft office excel 2003 and 2007 we are going to choose microsoft office excel 2007 so when you will open your Microsoft Excel worksheet your spreadsheet will appear here I'm using the random spreadsheet related to sales of computer part you can choose any of the worksheet up to your choice let's begin with it here I'm considering the five people Rahul, Sanjay, Tarun, Kunal and Manoj who buy some products from computer sale. Let's find out how much money they had paid. So for finding it we will use some function and all of you know that functions always begin with equal to sign. So let's begin equal to sum. First we will write the starting cell address from where we have to start the values for adding that is C6 and the last address is G6. So we will write C6 colon G6. So let's write G6 bracket close and here we get the answer. That is 900. If I have to find out the sum of all the values, then I will use autofill option. That is drag and drop method to find the sum of all the values. This is a way to find the sum of the values. The best part of function is the moment you change the value, automatically the total sum is changed. Let's check once again. Here the value is 300 and the sum is 1500. But when I will change it into 600, then the sum is also automatically changed and it becomes 1800. Similarly, instead of 200, if I'll write 400, then the sum will be 2100. We will use the same criteria to find average of values maximum value and minimum value paid by the person so for finding average we will use equal to sign then the name of the function that is average first cell address that is h6 because we have to start from h6 to h10 so we will write h6 colon h10. We can also write h6 comma h7 comma h8 comma h9 and so on. So we will write h10 parenthesis close and then enter. Here the average is 1720 is the average of your sum. If we have to find out the person who paid the maximum value then we will write equal to max same technique h6 colon h10 first cell address and last cell address so here we will get the answer 
press the enter key and then press yes and here we get the answer 2100 and 2100 is paid by Rahul similarly if we have to find the minimum value paid by then we will write equal to min and then first cell address that is h6 colon and then last cell address that is h10 press enter key and then press yes and here we get the answer 1300 and 1300 is paid by Manoj please do the practice of functions and in the next part of the video we will discuss the question answers of the chapter thank you